What is up, YouTube world? Floyd Maximus Entertainment coming to you live from my parents' basement. We got some brand new middle linebacker ratings from Madden. Let's go check them out. So in at number five is Daryl Smith from Georgia Tech, formerly of the Jacksonville Jaguars, now in the Baltimore Ravens. He was signed following Ray Lewis's retirement. And believe it or not, he actually broke Ray Lewis's record for most pass deflections in a single season with 19. His first season with the Ravens, he led the team with 123 tackles. So this spot is well deserved. He has a 92 tackle, a 92 pursuit, 95 play rec to go along with the 84 zone coverage and a 69 man coverage. Not too bad. Just another note. Also, 90 overall middle linebackers are Lawrence Timmons of the Pittsburgh Steelers and Carlos Dansby of the Cleveland Browns. I don't know why Timmons didn't get a picture here, but EA, do your thing, girl. Coming in at number four with those luscious locks is Clay Smashews, the third out of USC. Now, this is kind of interesting because we all know he started his career as an outside linebacker. And last year, the Packers defense was not doing well until defensive coordinator Don Capers and Mike McCarthy decided that they were going to move Matthews to inside linebacker. And let me tell you, this definitely drastically improved that defense. And in the final eight games, Matthews had eight and a half sacks. Now that's ridiculous. So Clay's got a 96 pursuit, a 90 tackle, 88 play wreck a 75 zone coverage, and a 65 man coverage to go along with a 100 haircut rating. Now, let me tell you, those locks are looking tight in that rain right now. Damn! <laughs> Number three, Bobby Wagner. He's part of the MOB of the Seattle Seahawks, the man of boom. Crazy stat, he's the all-time leader in Super Bowl tackles, and he has two twos, 22. Booby Wagner has got some nice stats, 97 tackle, as well as 96 pursuit. He's going to be all over the ball this year in Madden 16. Also has a 90 play recognition and very solid in zone, 85 zone and a 70 man. Number two, LeVarro Bowflex Bowman. I did say LeVarro. He's great friends with LeVar Arrington. Also, Bowflex Bowman has a degree in crime and justice. Oh! He's also good friends with Kevin Durant. All the linebackers left in San Francisco. All those friends left. Now it's just Bowman back there. Let's see how he does this year. Now, after missing all of last season, he's excited to get back on the field with none of his friend linebackers because they all retired. They're old. Anyways, he has a 97 tackle and a 96 pursuit. So those are thick, solid, tight stats. 92 block shed, he'll get to the quarterback, as well as 88 play recognition. Solid in zone, 82 zone, and 73 man for number 53 in the gold and red. And number one is Luke, the Duke, Keekly, out of Boston College, represent Massachusetts, except for the Patriots. But, Luke Keekly is your number one middle linebacker, and let me tell you something, it's August, and so is his middle name, so that's awesome, Luke Keekly month, and if you guys want to know a little fun fact, him and his family are avid outdoorsmen, and Luke Keekly <laughs> began bird hunting at the age of four. So there's a little fun fact for you guys out there if you cared. During the Panthers playoff victory over the Cardinals, he had three defensive stops to go along with 10 tackles, an interception, and two passes defended. As for his stats, the EA scouts must have been watching him at four years old hunting birds because they gave him a 99 pursuit, ladies and gentlemen, and he has a 98 tackle, and his coverage skills are amazing. 85 zone, 70 man, 72 catch. I want that user picks with Luke Keekley. 98 play rec, and that's about it. Thank you for watching. We're out. Let us know how EA did. Do you agree with their rankings? If not, drop a comment below and let us know who you think should be there. Once again, we're out from Floyd Maximus.